Collecting all four copies of the Guns and Bullets skill books in Fallout New Vegas will increase your gun skill and in this video I will show you the location to all four copies. Hi, I'm Mo and I'm trapped in Fallout. The first copy is found in the Nevada Highway Petrol Station. It is directly south of Prim and northeast of the Mojave Outpost. Once you make it, just go ahead and go inside. And once inside, just look ahead of you and you should be right here on top of this desk. A second copy is found in Raoul's shack. It is directly south of Nellis Air Force Base. Once you make it to the location, go inside the shack. And as soon as you enter, if you look to your immediate left and down, you should be inside this crate. The third copy is found inside the Gomorrah Casino. And to get to that casino, you will need to go through the strip north gate. It is directly north of Camp McCarran and west of the gun runners. So once you make it to the location, just go ahead and go inside. At the moment you're inside, on the right, we should see the casino. So if you look to your right, you should see the entrance of the casino, which is right over there. Again, go ahead and go inside. So it's right over here. Once inside, you will be asked to hand over your guns. Just go ahead and do that. You'll get these back. With that done, we now need to make our way to the very back of this room. Now, while I do that, quick note, there will be two doors that will actually be locked and you will need to unlock them. Now, one possible way to unlock them is to wait and do the How Little We Know quest, but ignoring that requirement, you can actually just pick the locks, but you will also need stealth boards to sort of get beyond this. So this door will be locked. The moment you unlock it, this guard will actually attack you. So what you will need to do is just unlock this door using a stealth boy at the same time. That way he won't see you when you're unlocking it. With that done, what we need to do is go through this corridor on the top floor and we will enter this sort of pool table area. If you look to your right, so this second door to your right, this will also be locked, which you will need to unlock. Once unlocked, if you just go inside, the book can be found on the shelf right over here. The final copy of the book is found in Vault 34. It is directly east of the NCR sharecroppers farms and west of the cap counterfeiting shack. Now before we go in, a bit of a warning. This book is rather difficult to get, so it's probably best that you actually try to get this book when you are actually exploring Vault 34 and trying to sort of complete any relevant quest or anything like that. Generally exploring, this book is rather difficult to get because the entire vault is filled with high level ghouls and various other creatures and not to mention the radiation. So before going in, it is best to actually take a couple of radexes to help reduce the radiation. So with that, go ahead and go inside. So once inside, you will find yourself in this cave. Now, luckily, this cave for the most part is a very linear path. So just simply follow the path and eventually you will get to the entrance of the vault. Now, notice I'm just taking this path. There really aren't any forks as such. There are sort of small dead ends, but if you just follow this path, eventually you should make it to the entrance of the vault. So what we will do is we should almost be there. So if we just take this corner over there, so from here, you should be able to see the entrance to the vault. So now that we're inside the vault, again, another warning, this vault is a very maze-like vault. It's very difficult to navigate, so I'm going to try and provide as clear of instructions as I can. So as soon as you enter the vault and sort of get into this large entrance, look to your right and then go down this set of stairs. And as you do that and emerge back in the room, look to your right again, go through this door that seems to be broken, look to your right again and follow the stairs sign. So go down. And again, just follow the stairs side. And now from here, you will see a corridor. Don't go into any rooms, just follow the corridor. So ignoring the operations area, follow the corridor. And when you get to this first fork from here, look to your right and you should see this flooded area. What we need to do is go into the flooded area and keep on going north and then look to your left and then search this school and take this Vault 34 security terminal password from him. With that, Go back out and from here, you should be back at the fork now. Look to your right and follow the corridor. And as you're following the corridor, this time look to your left and what you want to do is locate the clinic. From here, go through the clinic and sort of hug the northeast side of the wall and then go through this entrance over here into this other corridor. Again, follow this through 
And when you follow this through, notice that this door is now open and it's flooded. Again, just follow. Don't go through the right doors. Go through the first left door into the utility room. From here, look to your left and you will see a very hard terminal. What you will need to do is unlock this terminal. So go ahead and unlock it. Once you've unlocked it, go ahead and select system. And from here, select activate pump station. And what that will do is now unflood that room and we will go back into it. So from here, go back to the corridor, look to your right. And now notice this door that was previously open is now shut. Go ahead and go inside. So follow it through, go down the stairs. And from here, look to your right and now go through this door. So once in this area, look to your left and follow this corridor through into the security room. And if you look to your left, you will see another terminal. Go ahead and access this terminal. And from here, select system and then disengage the lock to the overseer's room. And now we will need to go into the overseer's office. So to do that, just follow the exit back out. So the way you came into this area, just go ahead and go back out. So once out, what you want to do is again, go out of this area also. So go back to the first floor. And from here, now what we need to do is follow this way. So we want to head left and we want to go through the clinic. So this time what you want to do is sort of head southwest. And when you sort of get out of the clinic, so we should be now outside the clinic, look to your left and follow this way through and you will eventually go to the officer's office. Once you make it, go down the stairs and then go through the corridor on the right and then go into the overseer's office. Once inside, the overseer will be in here, so you will need to kill him. And once you've done that, just go ahead and search him and on him you will find the overseer's password. Use that password to now access this terminal over here, then go into system and then open the armory door. With that, now just go ahead and exit the terminal and now we can finally gain access to the armory, which is where the skill book is. So again, just follow your way out using exactly the same path you followed to actually go into the overseer's office. Once on site, from here, what you want to do is go this way and then in this time, go through the clinic again. And what we want to do is basically go to the area where we went to that first terminal. So again, follow this corridor. And now at the very end of this corridor is the door to the armory right over there. So just go ahead and go inside. Once inside the armory, go down the stairs and then emerge into the corridor. From here, what you want to do is go to the common room. So look to your left and just follow this all the way down to the very end, go into the room. And from here in between these two sofas will be the final copy of the guns and bullet skill book. Collecting all copies of the guns and bullets skill books will increase your gun skill. Why not also increase your repair skill by collecting all four copies of the Dean's electronics skill books? Click on the video you see on the screen now to find out more.